Final numbers from Atlanta. Georgia Tech pulling off the upset against number four, Virginia, 68-64. to And Dave Odom, uh, Brian Gregory uh, shuffling the lineup, and it paid off in the first half especially. And that might have been the key to the whole game is just shuffling that lineup. And right out of the box, Quinn Stevens hits a couple, two or three uh, threes, uh, something they hadn't had lately. Adam Smith follows with one, and, of course, Jacobs challenges the uh, great Virginia post defense inside, and he comes back across splits that double team and gets the ball to fall a home. And Malcolm Brogdon, uh, the co-player, preseason player of the year, played well in the first half, but he was about the only one. Huh? Well, he was. If it uh, hadn't been for his 11 points in the first half, I'm not sure that uh, Virginia would have even reached double figures. Didn't get much out of anybody else. But when you got to the second half, of course, uh, again, James White, uh, again, the change in the in the starting lineup, man, what an offensive glass. And to make that possible, he went high into the air. And a follow shot there uh, again by James White. And on the second follow shot, but Virginia was not to be denied. They made a strong comeback. Uh, Mario Shayok uh, led that charge in return. He had to follow shot. Good passing on the backside. It finds Shayok again for a three. He tied the game at 49. Speaking of a three, boy, Georgia Tech was hot. They were, and, and, it, and it went right back to the lineup change with Quentin Stevens and his two free throws. And down with the five seconds on the shot clock, Adam Smith on the backaway jump shot, which really was the dagger. 53% from three. Uh, this is the ACC Digital Network. Georgia Tech beating Virginia 68-64.